Ken is struggling with a decision. His partner wants to have a child, but Ken feels unsure about becoming a parent. This dilemma is causing him a lot of stress and is affecting their relationship. Ken isn't sure if talking will help, but he decides to see a therapist. During the appointment, his therapist suggests using chair work. What is chair work? Chair work refers to a group of action-based methods. Chair work allows individuals to speak directly to their difficulties rather than just talking about them. This might sound a little strange, but it can be a very powerful and helpful experience. How does chair work work? Chair work is based on a few key ideas. Number one, people are made up of different parts. Part of Ken likes the idea of becoming a parent, and another part sees the downsides to it. Number two, these parts of the self share information and relate to one another. The two sides of Ken are in conflict. One part wants to be a father, and another does not, and this is making it hard for him to reach a decision. Number three, interacting with these parts can change our minds and our lives. Doing so could help Ken better understand his uncertainty, resolve his conflict, and see his dilemma differently. Chairwork uses these principles to help people address their difficulties and dilemmas in life. So what does Chairwork involve? Chairwork can help people in different ways. Interviews help us explore the different parts of ourselves. Ken moves to a chair and speaks as the part of himself which wants a child. The therapist asks this part of Ken questions to better understand its perspective. Ken then moves to another chair and is questioned as the part which doesn't want a child. This helps Ken better understand the two sides of his dilemma. Dialogues help us talk with the different parts of ourselves. Ken changes seats and outlines the reasons why he wants a child. Returning to his first chair, Ken responds with the reasons why he doesn't. Ken switches between the two chairs so that the two sides can have a conversation with one another. As he moves back and forth between the seats, Ken begins to reach a decision. Depictions help individuals explore problems from different angles by imagining that these are represented by chairs. Ken imagines that an empty seat represents becoming a parent and moves it somewhere in the room which captures how he feels about this issue. Deciding where and how to place the chair helps Ken clarify his attitudes, relationships and feelings towards parenthood. Disclosures help us talk through and process experiences. Ken changes seats and talks through his thoughts and feelings about becoming a parent as openly and as honestly as possible. Doing this several times helps him really connect with and process his feelings around this dilemma so that his preferences become clearer. Role plays help us change troubling events from the past and prepare for future events. Ken has decided that he wants to become a parent, but not right now. His therapist suggests doing a role play so that Ken can practice having this conversation with his partner. Ken plays himself in one chair and his therapist plays his partner in another so that they can practice and fine tune helpful ways of communicating. Witnessing helps us stand back and observe thoughts and feelings and situations which are troubling us. Ken stands behind his seat at the end of chair work so that he can relate to his dilemma from a new perspective. Looking at himself as a compassionate observer, Ken begins to separate from his problem and look at it more flexibly, objectively and compassionately. So what is chair work like? Chair work can feel a little unusual at first. It's not often that we speak directly to a problem or to an empty chair. However, Research shows that Chairwick can help address many issues, including self-criticism, relationship difficulties, past traumas, difficult decisions, and many others. In many ways, Ken was right. Talking about becoming a parent wasn't the answer. But talking to this dilemma, well, that proved to be really helpful.